Yep. 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 Hello everybody, you're watching Real Russian Channel, that's the deepest insights into the real Russian life. My name is Sergei Baklikov and together with me, a guest from the United States, from Winchester, Virginia, <coughs> Edward Cronkite. I'm Ed Cronkite. Cronkite. Yes, and so we continue our, you know, tour in a Kazan, Kazan, the capital of Tatarstan Republic of Russia. After Kazan Kremlin, which is right behind us, we now go into Baumana, Baumana Street. This is the most famous pedestrian street in Kazan. You know, and really, if you will visit Kazan, it's, uh, it's easier right after the Kazan Kremlin, which is there you can go to Bauman Street, which is starts here. So let's start our journey, our walk through this amazing street. Well, this is actually an analog of Arbat Street, Arbat Street and uh, Moscow, pedestrian street in Moscow. You know, guys, it's a real huge enjoyment walking through the pedestrian streets because everything here made for you to enjoy, you know, uh, beautiful buildings, uh, interesting stores, cafe, restaurants. The only thing that I can't really understand here is what it is, what it is. Any ideas, folks? Looks like a good place for a power uh, planner. It seems like uh, something hidden and definitely it must be something temporary because this is the only ugly thing in all Baumana Street uh, that I ever seen. Must you know? be a dozen of these things. Well, Vika, Vika with us, still a little upset that uh, we are still making our job. Uh, filming the job? video. <laughs> yes, I've got a job and I'm not at home <laughs> and not incurably ill. Oh, he's fine, he's fine. <laughs> Do not worry. Yes, also now using this moment, let me tell you about uh, what it is was all about. I'm home, I lost my job and incurably ill. Well, this is nothing but just a song performed by David Bowie, which is called DJ, written and released in 1979. I'm home, I lost my job and incurably ill. You think this, play. you think this, this is here, release him. Really? I've got a girl out there, I suppose. I think she's dancing. Well, I know that, uh, you know, I'm a very terrible singer, but but uh, actually i don't pretend to be uh, a public artist so uh, why not to sing sometimes just for myself and for my audience <laughs> everything for the people those uh, even my audience even my loyal you know viewers not everybody appreciated it because uh, this is probably the most uh, unlikable video well still still more likes than dislikes but uh really uh as there was as much dislikes as i don't remember when i was getting so much of them now let me tell you the story about this uh restaurant which is called twin peaks yesterday with edwards with victoria and my wife we was walking here, got inside, and what we have seen there, actually half-naked ladies. The good half. <laughs> and now uh, here we can see uh, something what is becomes more and more popular in Russia, so-called quests in reality. It's like, you know, uh, you play the game, computer games, you played quests when you need to search something that to go forward, yeah. to move forward. So it's the same, but not in game, but in reality. So that's why it is called quest in reality. For example, glass labyrinth or uh, escape from the jailhouse. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's it. So, uh, you know, you're getting inside of the room, inside of the object, and you have like, let's say, uh, maybe an hour 
and uh, during this hour with a group of your friends with all the participants you have to find the way to open everything and uh, to to find uh, to find the guests it now becomes more and more popular in russia such uh, such a kind of entertain entertainment well uh we can see a lot of people even though it's a usual day today it's thursday right thursday uh lunch time and same as in moscow and arbat this street always attracts a lot of people because uh, it attracts tourists it's a uh, first category next thing just uh, local people uh, who just want to enjoy walking or maybe wants to meet with uh, somebody it's uh, also very popular as a place to meet place to meet you know oh, let's hey, let's let's yes let's meet Beautiful at bauman day. let's go down here now let's look at this carriage one of the places that is so adorable by kids uh, they love climb on a you know such a carriage and photograph there now you see uh, how really uh, how really demandable how really popular this place because we see a lot of uh, parents who photograph their kids here the building of uh, theater 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 kachalov kachalov theater at such a place as um, you know um, it's uh, really good to have a place like theater because uh, this is a place definitely for creative for aspired people and this is a restaurant and hotel which is called nagai by the way let me tell you that if you will come to kazan and if you will want to stay in a hotel right at Baumana street so nagai is the place nagai is the place where you can stay and to live right on a Bauman PD strand street oh, overlooking this beautiful yes. boulevard yes here. nagai nagai is uh, is a hotel from where you will get right on the Bauman street this is something like a local uh, alley of stars mm -hmm. alley of fame and uh, here mostly noticed Salavat. yes uh, let's say Salavat Fathidinov the local Tatar ah. stars because Salavat Fathidinov is the musician mm -hmm. Tatar musician hmm. yes, interesting yes, yes. interesting one here yes very interesting a Tatar LA of fame that's really curious a little recognition stone for them well actually i can say that you know uh tatters same as uh, bashkirs uh really uh proud of their nation and uh, makes everything to keep uh, that to support their culture to support their culture and uh, this is same as we have seen in uh, moscow and in ufa zero kilometers yes zero point zero kilometer of uh, kazan of the republic of terrorism yes and here we can see how many kilometers let's say until rome uh moscow mecca mecca yes got a little music beaten here in the background people talking just walking along having some ice cream enjoying this beautiful beautiful day oh yeah uh, this is uh dobrea stalove dobre stalove and a little life hack from us uh this is the place where you can get a uh, pretty cheap meal uh but a very good meal you know uh, if you don't care too much about the design then that's place for you yeah it's cheap and tasty yes uh, people like that cheap and tasty, tasty. but uh, the interior is not the best oh my fountain probably it is called four frogs four frogs that's yes. good because exactly from their mouths we see the water goes out the water flows and uh, 
as far as I can see, this guy's throwing the coins. Salam alaikum. So if you will throw the coins, if you will throw the coins in the fountain, uh, probably uh, your desire, your wish, your, your wish, wish will, may not come, will come through. Yes, oh, might come through. Dreams really do come true. There a sushi shop which is uh, have an interesting name. It is called Rock and Rolls. Rock, Rock and Rolls. Rolls. Yes, Rolls. <laughs> yeah. Disco bar and DJ cafe Malibu. Malibu. Is it in California? Malibu. Malibu, California, overlooking the Pacific. Sits yes. High on some cliffs. Uh, this is a souvenir shop with a very original name. Matryoshka. I think that if if I would want uh, if I would want uh, to open uh, the souvenir store, yes. Matryoshka probably the first what would come up in my mind. So really very original name you got a uh, traffic policeman here with the uh, official mustache they almost wear that when they yes. carry their little black and white stuff. russian road policeman road policeman yeah keeping the road safe yeah haven't seen a 10 car pile up in days okay let's go let's go guys oh, fun stuff matryoshka the giant matryoshka look at this thing's uh, specific to our neighborhood Yep, she's Kazan Kremlin. She's telling a story. <clears throat> well, everywhere, uh, as everywhere now in Russia, as in uh, Moscow, and even in Ufa, here in Kazan, they are trying to develop the uh, bicycle traffic. So, uh, in uh, many places, we can meet the parkings for uh, bikes. Park them there and secure them. They'll be there when you get back. Yep. Sometimes uh, we can see that Baumana streets uh, crossing with a no less beautiful but not pedestrian streets. Yes, yeah, pretty good drivers. They'll stop and let you cross. Won't try to flatten you. Very nice. Polite people. Friendly people. I love them. In the evening time, uh, you can meet a lot of artists here. Mostly musicians who are playing uh, guitar or any other music instruments. Uh, also, uh, you can meet an artist like, you know, those ones who um, declare the rhymes. How you would call them? Rappers? Could uh, rappers? Rappers, but, but they are not making rap. They are just, uh, you know, uh, really read the rhymes of uh, popular Russian poets like Alexander oh, Pushkin, oh, okay. like uh, Vladimir Mayakovsky. Mayakovsky, yes. Yes. Well, Mayakovsky had a really very powerful rhymes. So, uh, probably that's why he became so much uh, respected. So much respected that in, uh, in the center of Moscow there, uh, his monuments and the station it's named after station. him. And this is definitely one, one of the you know, most beautiful metro stations ever. Yes, they're gorgeous. If you see Moscow, you're going to have to see and appreciate these. Also, we can see an artist like this who show uh, their animals like a parrot, like a monkeys. And probably they are making business offering to photograph with them in the hands or on the shoulder or or so. <laughs> and this is uh, the building of the State Bank. 
Very beautiful. The state bank. Государственный банк. Such a points where you can buy ice cream, drinks, and national tartar things like chuck chuck. Chuck chuck. Chuck chuck is tasty, you know. When we have been to Ufa, yes. we tried tried the one with you. Tasty, tasty snack. Yeah. That's uh, something what in Russia we say for tea. For tea. Kchayo. 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 Chuck chuck kchayo. I'm in. This is another beauty that you can meet in Kazan. While you will walk at Baumana Street. Yeah. Look at all that brickwork. Yep. 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 How many ones uh, can you stack bricks? Collins. 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 One of the most uh, popular brands for a clothing, mm -hmm. for a clothing. I recommend it. Yes, uh, Ed really can recommend you this because uh, Ed purchased, you know, a pants, like a jeans yeah, and a, a shirt there. Shirt there. Is it a shirt? Yes, indeed. I figured carry as little as you need. Buy what you need when you get to Moscow. Might as well dress like Moscovites. Well, it's a place to escape the rain for a minute. <laughs> maybe, maybe. <laughs> you know, maybe it's some kind of scanning of an information. Yeah, that's it. You walk through and just checking for uh, weapons and grenades, landmines. It's just a uh, really, <laughs> really nice, nice and snaky way to scan uh, foreign tourists to see what you've got, what, what an information you've got yes. from Russia and go, going to carry. I am not an American spy. <laughs> well, but uh, how we can believe you? Because if you would be, you wouldn't say this, we right? You'd have to torture me to find out for sure. <laughs> uh, I'm not going to admit to it easily. I'm here to study your Palmini technology. You have to taste every brand of vodka that you can find. Here we come. It looks like a city center. We've got lots of big commercial new buildings at the end of the walk street here. Got a nice big clock. Green things are planted and growing. You should see this place. All the flowers are really coming up in color. Yes, color. that's how we came to the end of Bauman Street. And this is the square which is known as the square of Tukai, Gabdula Tukai. Tukai. Yes, Tukai. He is uh, one of the Tatar personalities, which is pretty respected pretty in the uh, Republic of Tatarstan. He's achieved some fame. Yes, and again we can see uh, such a... Red bus, green bus, red bus, green bus. Yes. The Kazan Hotel, the Grand Red Kazan. bus, it's a bus. Green, it's a trolley bus, and that double decker is a definitely touristic, touristic train. Tourists, yes, tourist train. Uh, train bus, Russia. bus. <laughs> you can't see Russia from a double decker bus. Don't kid yourself. You got to get out and see the people. Okay, and that's where, together with Ed, I'm gonna tell you. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed walking through Baumana Pedestrian Street in Kazan, the capital of Tatarstan Republic of Russia. Beautiful. Comment, like, like. and subscribe. subscribe. Vika is still waiting for when we will go to Aquapar. Oh, would you like to go and step in the pool instead when we have a beer? <laughs> No? I don't no, think so. I'm not gonna dance on the floor. Okay, stay with us. Fuck up.